What's going on you guys? It's Randy with Full Throat Obsessions. I just got the summit all fixed up. I had to fix the rear diff. We ended up grenading the spider gears in the rear differential of the Traxxas Summit. If you guys remember the last video of the Traxxas Summit, we put the MXL 6S motor and speed control and we ended up grenading the diff. So I got the, the rear diff fixed up last night. We went ahead and fixed, up, fixed the X-Max. We put a, the blue anodized aluminum steering arms on it. Today we're gonna put these trucks head to head and have a little tug of war. Right off the bat, the X-Max got a huge advantage by its size and weight, but the Summit has low range with front and rear locking differentials. To make things a little more fair, I'm running the, the X-Max on 6S. So both of these trucks will be on 6S. And we're gonna be trying it on multiple different surfaces. The first couple surfaces are gonna be slick and then we're gonna to move to some other grippier surfaces to make sure we do a fair comparison on both these trucks. It is a little windy out here today, but I got my windscreen on, so hopefully we're hoping to drown some of that wind out. But without further ado, let's go ahead and do it. All right, the first surface, we're gonna try on the pavement. We got the dividing line in the center. I got the summit in low range with the diffs locked in. Let's go ahead and do it. X Max all the way. All right, for our second pull, I took the summit out of low range. We're going to try it in high range now. Let's go ahead and do it. The Summit did a little bit better in high range. We're gonna go one more time on the concrete and I'm just gonna give them both all they have. Let's go ahead and do it. <laughs> all right, you guys, we had to cut that one a little short. We end up breaking the MIP dry shaft on the tracks of Summit. You can see right there, it started splitting the pinhole right down the center. That's actually pretty surprising it didn't shear that pin before it started cracking the actual dry shaft itself. I'll probably end up trying some E-Revo shafts or something, some steel shafts. But the X-Max was just dominating all the way. The extra weight really helped it out in that tug of war. I wanted to do it in the rocks and the dirt, but we just didn't get to that point till the dry shaft broke. But as always, if you guys like my videos, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.